Hi, I was gonna make a short video about shoes again uh, because when I was younger I fractured my leg so it became like one and a half centimeter shorter my femur on the right side and that's kind of annoying if you have this problem because you kind of will be uh, like walking very awkwardly and probably get hip pain so what you can do is you can either lengthen the, the leg and I was at the hospital talking to the doctor you can kind of either shorten the other side or lengthen this one uh, or you can wait until you need a hip replacement and then they can fix it then but what are you going to do until then and I opted not to extend my leg and I'm going to do it whenever I need a new hip if I am ever going to need one I'm going to do the leg lengthening then but that means that I have to fix my shoes up and that's what I'm going to show you because I've fixed shoes for so many years now that I might be able to give you a few tips and tricks. So let's have a look at my shoes. So we can take these ones first. These are some cheap shoes I bought from China. So and now my shoes are really good but you gotta try it. So what, I, what I've done is I've used many layers so I have like a, some kind of thing I bought in a Chinese place and then I got my heel chip and then I got some kind of red thing. I, I bought it with whatever I found and then I cut them so I get the, the length. But since I have uh, 14 millimeters of this stuff, there's, there are not many shoes that you can actually use because shoes are just usually too short so your heel comes up and it's just not comfortable to walk or run in this stuff if you're gonna have to like raise them so that's why the solution I came up with is um, oh, like a thick I think it's used for cars or something it's kind of rubbery like this uh, I have a lot of this you can you can probably get it yourself it's very um, sturdy and it kind of has some friction here for the heel so it kind of becomes just like an extension here and then I super glue it and I, for this shoe, I actually used uh, staples, so, so it really sticks. So, but I, I mainly I have a, a really great glue um, that I attach it with, and then it just sits fantastic on the shoe. I can go running, uh, everything, and I don't even notice that it's uh, anything in here. And I feel super balanced, like a normal person would. Okay, and then for some other shoes, and you know, I'm, uh, I really like the barefoot shoes and I walked in them since you know, 2010, so almost 15 years. But uh, you know, sometimes you wanna look a bit stylish. So I found these shoes, I found them on AliExpress. They're like 20, 20 euros or something. And they're really, really soft and they look kind of decent. Okay, they're not like perfect, like um, like we were barefoot or anything, but they work, they work so well. And then, yeah, I just put in the stuff uh, to my exact height and it took actually many months of like you know every two weeks I had to like put in a layer or take out the layer until I found my perfect height and then same thing here I've just attached like this rubbery thing at the back so when my heel go in, goes in here uh, like if I wouldn't have this 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 uh, edge here is just too low but with this one my Foot just sits there like super nice and then on the other side I, I took some some let me see if you can see yeah it was it, it was getting too big so I just took some material and I glued here and this is just you know common sense you know if you have if your shoes are not fitting you, you need to do something about it and then I have the, the heel ship in here as well uh, just like you can see in this one yeah for the heel to come up but i already talked about that on the video i did like years ago and yeah for the same thing for like i live in spain so we have a lot of flip-flops on so yeah you see there and same thing on these ones and flip-flops need to be really hard otherwise it feels like walking on quicksand and you're gonna get really tired but here yeah you see my left one uh, and then my right one but uh, once i fix them up uh, it's uh, super nice and um, I can walk and you know live like a normal person without pain I don't even notice it the, the thing is though that I always need to wear shoes otherwise I'm kind of tilted um, but I guess that's the price you're gonna have to pay when you're gonna fracture your femur right 
but you know it's a i think it's the best solution until i can get my hip done or i can do it now but i think i'll wait if i ever do it if i ever need to with these shoes uh, life is good so yeah maybe you get some ideas of how you can fix up your shoes all right thanks guys bye bye